my children see i told you about the how to read the time on the clock this is the clock okay and as to children this is this may be in any shape okay it may be a rectangle shape shape triangle shape whatever the shape may be see the content will be like this okay and it has what the numbers on it like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 okay and see here see it has small divisions like this see here from between for see here the dot 12 to 1 see the dotted spot are they know the dot what dots see here in between it it is divided into five equal divisions like 1 2 3 4 5 so from 12 to 1 see what are it is it has what small divisions okay see so look here children what that clock is has a equal divisions around 60 equal divisions how many equal divisions are there in a clock 60 equal divisions and each division denotes one minute okay one division is nothing but one minute okay one minute and from 12 to 1 there are five minutes how many divisions are there since five divisions are there from 12 to 1 we will take it as five minutes and 1 to 2 five minutes and 2 to 3 five minutes if and see here these are all the hands of the clock what are these these are all the hands of the clocks look here this is a short hand we call it as what have a hand ha hand or have a hand okay and the long hand we what we call it as minute hand and this one more hand is they know that is the second hand okay second hand usually most clocks will have only two hands okay see the have a hand see how much long no children see here it is have a hand and the short hand is the what sorry the long hand is the minute hand and the short hand is the what hand have a hand and the one more hand thin hand is there no that is the second hand okay have a hand minute hand second hand okay understood come we'll see what about the what time okay yeah on the clock look here children what is the time on the clock now look here the short hand is at what 6 okay and the long hand is at 12 so what's the time here 6 o'clock okay if the minute hand is at 12 and the have a hand is at any number the time will be the number okay i'll show you if it is 7 o'clock where the short hand will be and the long hand will be look here children see now the short hand is at 7 and the long hand is at 12 okay that is nothing but the how much what's the time now 7 o'clock 7 o'clock okay see understood the minute hand is at 12 okay and the have a hand is at 7 so the time is 7 o'clock come we'll see about see if it is in what minute and hours how to find it look here children what's the time now see here see look here the short hand that is the have a hand is in between 7 and 8 so we should take the what a small number compared to 7 and comparing 7 and 8 7 is a smaller number no so it was at have a 7 hours and if you come to minutes the long hand see the minute hand is at 4 okay so how many divisions are there from starting from 12 see from 12 to 1 5 minutes and 1 to 2 5 minutes 2 to 3 5 minutes 3 to 4 5 minutes so you add it 5 10 15 20 so what's the time now 7 20 what's the time now children 7 20 so now you understand no how to see the how to read the time on the clock see what's the time the time the short hand is in between 7 and 8 and the smaller number is 7 so you take it as 7 and the minute hand is at 4 so it is 7 20 okay come we'll see one more time Look here, children. What's the time now on the clock? Now see here. Where is the short hand? It is between eight and nine. So we'll take at eight hours. And what about the minutes? Look, it is in where? It is in three. Okay, it is in three. So what is the minutes? Five, ten, fifteen. So what's the time? Eight hours, fifteen minutes is the time. Okay, eight hours, fifteen minutes. So in this way, we can see the. time on the we can read the time by seeing the hands of the clock we can read the time on the clock and 
us to children come we'll go to next topic and we know children see one day means what from midnight 12 o'clock to afternoon 12 it will what from 12 to what 12 o'clock okay that means from midnight 12 to afternoon 12 it will be half a day from again from what a noon 12 to again midnight 12 it will take what 12 hours no so this 12 hours plus 12 hours makes a that means the 24 hours make a day so one day means how many how many hours will be there in one day 24 hours the clock will complete two rotations okay from 12 to again 12 one rotation and 12 to 12 again one rotation so the clock will take how many rotations two rotations to complete one day that means what 24 hours make a one day understood children come we'll see that so another next topic is days of the week what the days of the week okay we know 24 hours make one day what 24 hours make one day and also we know seven days make a week so how many days are there in a week seven days are there okay how many days are 